And this is a really interesting metaphor for life. Enter with a happy heart. Hello, I'm Shopkin Girl and I'm going to show you where Daddy, Cheryl and Sienna went today. Well, we started in Lefkada and we got a hire car from Avis. We've done a very brave thing. We've hired a car for the day. A Citroen. <laughs> and Mike's driving on the wrong side of the road, which is the right side of the road here. And I'm very, very nervous. So anyway, we got to this monastery, which was somewhere around here, and there were a whole heap of women with black veils over their head, and they were obviously in mourning. Very sad. Tisk tisk. So then we went and did, we drove along this road, and it went up and up and up. How's the serenity driving up narrow streets this wide? on the wrong side of the road and having bloody impatient Greek, old Greek men on motorbikes bloody coming to get out of their effing way. Up and Sienna in the back started to feel sick and Mummy certainly started to feel sick. Hello, don't take the camera from me. And then, anyway, we went down here, we went down here and then we started to see the most awesome views. Well, uh, we've driven about an hour. We are um, on the hill above Porto Katsiki and the water is topaz blue or aquamarine colour. What a beach! Amazing but popular. Noise pollution and cuts on the cuts. Lovely beach, very crowded. But this is when we especially wish we were back on the boat and not a one of the tourist pack. Mike's getting out of the water on his bottom because the rocks hurt your feet really badly here. And we didn't bring our Greek shoes with us. And that's the reason why you don't want a monohull and that's why you don't want to be on a popular tourist beach. Disco music about to start. We're having a lunch and swim at Bilby restaurant. No one here but us. Everyone's down on the beach. They get deliver food to the beach as well so you don't actually need to come up here. Today's our last day in Greece and it's with a touch of sadness that uh, that we're all leaving, but uh, we're on to our next little adventure, which is a stop in London, and we're going to do all the touristy things, and then we're going home, and we're going to be seriously planning the next phase. My feet are not kindergarten. Here we are in the little town of Zanthia. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> Pretty hair raising. So babe, um, one of the things that uh, we've done is walk the back streets of Lefkes. Yep. And um, I've always been one for trying to hunt out, whoops, have we lost the kid? No, we haven't. Uh, hunt out uh, special places. And for the last two nights, we've eaten at a little place called... The Lighthouse. The Lighthouse. And for the third night in a row, we're eating out there. The Lighthouse. <laughs> so our first tip for um, Greece is walk the back streets, don't get sucked into the tourist areas where the food is invariably average. Hunt out the little special places. Here's a little example. Who would have thought in the back streets of uh, Lefkes, babe, was... A Havana Club. 
a Havana club. The standard way of getting around in Greece and don't bother looking to the left or right. And here we are, coming into our own favourite little restaurant, the Lighthouse Restaurant. There is the bread man, Nikos. X marks the spot. Must be an omen. We might be coming back. Same girl from last night. 